the most painful diseases in human history. Rabies. Rabies is often called the most terrifying disease on Earth because once symptoms start, survival is almost zero. Cause. The cause is the rabies virus. Transmission mechanism. It usually spreads through the bite of an infected animal, most often a dog or a bat. The virus travels along nerves toward the brain. It inflames the brain and the spinal cord. Symptoms, pain. The pain is not just physical. Patients feel burning at the bite site, severe anxiety, muscle spasms, and a horrifying symptom called hydrophobia. Even the thought of swallowing water can trigger throat spasms and choking. Light and sound can feel unbearable. Hallucinations and confusion set in. Impact. Without post-exposure vaccination, death usually occurs within days of symptom onset. Entire communities in some regions still fear night bites and bat exposure for good reason. Today, rabies is preventable if treated fast. Wash the wound right away, seek medical care, and start the vaccine series and, when indicated, rabies immune globulin. For pets and people in high-risk areas, vaccination is key. In public health, controlling dog vaccination saves the most lives. Tetanus. Tetanus is a disease where your own muscles lock so hard, pain can feel unbearable. Cause. The cause is a bacterium called Clostridium tetani. Transmission or mechanism. It enters through cuts, puncture wounds, or contaminated injuries. It does not spread person to person. The bacterium makes a powerful toxin, tetanospasmin, that blocks the signals that relax muscles. The result is non-stop contraction. Symptoms, pain. The classic sign is lockjaw, where jaw muscles clamp shut. Then the neck, back, and chest seize. Spasms can be triggered by a simple touch, a noise, or a draft of air. The pain is intense and can break bones or tear muscles. Breathing can become difficult. Impact. Without intensive care, tetanus can be deadly. In places with low vaccination rates or limited trauma care, the risk remains high. Today, tetanus is preventable. Routine vaccination and boosters work. Clean wounds well. For risky wounds and uncertain vaccination histories, doctors may give a booster and tetanus immune globulin. Fibrodysplasia ossificans progressive. Fibrodysplasia ossificans progressive turns soft tissue into bone piece by piece. Cause. The cause is a rare genetic mutation in the ACVR1 gene. Transmission mechanism. It is not infectious. It is inherited or occurs as a new mutation. The mutation misguides the body's repair system. Instead of healing with normal tissue, the body lays down bone outside the skeleton. Symptoms, pain. Pain begins after minor injuries, injections, or even muscle strain. Swollen, painful flare-ups gradually harden. Over time, muscles in the neck, shoulders, and back ossify. Joints fuse. Movement becomes limited, then nearly impossible. The pain is deep and constant during flares, like bones growing where they should not. Impact. FOP is extremely rare, but the suffering is profound. Everyday actions, raising an arm, turning a head, can become impossible. Today, there is no cure yet. Management focuses on avoiding trauma, treating inflammation during flares, and protecting breathing and mobility. Research into targeted drugs offers hope, but patients need careful, gentle care to prevent triggers. Cluster headaches. Cluster headaches are called suicide headaches because the pain can be that extreme. Cause. The exact cause is not fully understood, but the hypothalamus and the trigeminal nerve are involved. 
transition mechanism. Cluster headaches are not contagious. They strike in cycles or clusters, often at the same time each day or night. Blood vessel changes and nerve activation in the face produce intense pain and autonomic symptoms. Symptoms, pain. The pain hits one side of the head centered behind the eye. It is sharp, drilling, and explosive. The eye waters, the nose runs, the eyelid may droop. People often pace or rock because sitting still feels impossible. Attacks can last 15 minutes to three hours and strike multiple times a day for weeks. Impact. Quality of life crashes during a cluster period. Sleep vanishes. Work and relationships suffer. Many patients fear the next cycle more than anything else. Today, high flow oxygen and certain medications can abort attacks. Preventive drugs can shorten or reduce clusters. New nerve modulation and CGRP targeted options bring cautious optimism, but access and correct diagnosis are critical. Necrotizing fasciitis. Necrotizing fasciitis destroys tissue so fast that hours matter. Cause. The cause is usually bacteria like group A streptococcus, sometimes mixed infections. Transmission slash mechanism. It enters through a cut, bite, burn, or surgical wound. Bacteria release toxins that shut down blood supply to tissue. The fascia and skin die. The body's nerves get damaged, so early pain can be out of proportion to the visible injury. Symptoms, pain. The first sign is severe, spreading pain that feels wrong for such a small wound. Swelling grows. The skin turns red, then dusky, then black. Fever and shock follow. The pain can be scorching and relentless until nerves die, which can give a false sense of relief even as tissue destruction accelerates. Impact. Without rapid surgery and antibiotics, death rates are high. Survivors may lose limbs or large areas of tissue. The physical and emotional scars are life-changing. Today, Immediate action saves lives. Broad-spectrum antibiotics, aggressive surgical removal of dead tissue, critical care for shock, and sometimes hyperbaric oxygen. Early recognition, pain out of proportion, is everything. Shingles. Shingles is the comeback of chickenpox, and it can burn like live wires under the skin. Cause. The cause is the varicella zoster virus, the same virus that causes chickenpox. Transmission mechanism. After chickenpox, the virus goes dormant in nerve roots. Years later, it can reactivate a shingles. It travels along a single nerve pathway, or dermatome, to the skin. Symptoms pain. The warning is tingling or burning on one side of the body or face. Then a stripe of blisters appears. The pain is electric, stabbing, and sensitive even to clothing or a breeze. In some people, pain continues long after the rash heals. That's postherpetic neuralgia, chronic nerve pain that can be severe. Impact. Shingles can disrupt work, sleep, and mental health. Involvement around the eye is a medical emergency because vision can be damaged. Today, antiviral drugs help if started early. Pain control may require multiple approaches. Vaccination in older adults and high-risk groups sharply reduces the risk and the severity of shingles and long-term nerve pain. Gout Gout is an ancient disease that can make a single joint feel like it is full of broken glass. Cause. The cause is too much uric acid in the blood, which forms sharp crystals in joints. Transmission mechanism. Diet, genetics, kidney function, and certain medicines can raise uric acid. When crystals deposit, the joint lining erupts in inflammation. Symptoms, pain. The classic attack is the big toe at night. The joint becomes red, hot, and swollen. The pain is stabbing and intense. 
even a bed sheet touching the toe can feel unbearable. Other joints can be hit too. Ankles, knees, hands. Impact. Repeated flares can damage joints and tendons. Quality of life drops as people fear the next attack. Today, acute flares are treated with anti-inflammatory drugs, colchicine, or steroids when appropriate. Long-term control means lowering uric acid with medication, adjusting diet, staying hydrated, and managing weight and other risk factors. Cancer pain. Cancer pain is not one thing. It is many kinds of pain happening at once. Cause. The cause is cancer itself and the effects of treatment. Transmission mechanism. Not infectious. Tumors can invade bone, compress nerves, block organs, or trigger inflammation. Treatments like surgery, chemotherapy, and radiation can cause nerve injury and long-term pain. Symptoms, pain. Pain can be aching in the bones, burning along nerves, cramping in organs, or deep pressure from swelling. It can be constant or come in spikes that take your breath away. Sleep breaks, appetite fades, mood changes, families feel it too. Impact. Cancer pain is one of the most feared parts of serious illness. Untreated, it steals dignity and connection. Today, relief is possible. Strong pain medicines, nerve blocks, targeted radiation, palliative procedures, physical therapy, and counseling all help. Modern cancer care treats the whole person, not just the tumor. Early palliative care improves quality of life and can even help people live longer.